hardest songs I've ever learned in my life, mind you. And if anybody knows knows me, I can encyclopedia lyrics. Sean is not an easy guy to try to cover. Not you a- killed it, though. I mean, I, I was watching from the front at that show. And uh, it was a, just a sensitive thing for me to even be a part of because of things were stupid back then. And, sure, sure. And so I'm, I'm watching from the crowd, and, and as soon as that first, and you you killed it, dude. Yeah. It was awesome. Just I'd never seen violence before, you know? That was a great scene. So it was like, fuck, I'm watching violence play. And it was this wow. awesome vibe. That must be so surreal. <laughs> because being out of Exodus a few times... I've got to, you know, I was I wasn't the original singer, so I got to look out. I, 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 what I, the way I look at it is, I got to be the outside looking in. You know what I mean? And I think that that's a great vantage point when you yeah. get to see that. You know what I mean? It's cool from, especially from your peers, all Obviously. paying tribute to you know the music that we had made and to you know Sean, this icon and this total, you know, uh, just figure on stage he's not easy to match and everybody coming huh. together and doing that so that kind of i mean rob sang that night we got together and played uh, world in the world and it was awesome and sean was so frail and just in such bad shape that it's just like i don't know if i'm gonna see him again right i don't know if i'm gonna see my L- friend again let alone get together and do what happened this yeah. weekend i mean it was like I said, how many times did I call you over the last yeah. couple of months? Going, so how is he? How does it look? Yeah. How's he? And you're like, I guess. And you were like, at first, you're like, I guess he's okay. Yeah. And I, you know, when I seen him the other day, does he look a little thinner? But man, he commanded well. Yeah. He wasn't huffing and puffing. He wasn't. Yeah. He, you know, he wasn't running crazy all over the stage. But Sean was never that really. Yeah. So well, he still has. A scar that hasn't healed. I can, you know, oh, <laughs> so he's like, he's like, I don't want anybody touching that. me. You know, you know, mm-hmm. anybody touches me, you know, I'll kill you. I kill you. Well, that's why. <laughs> I mean, I mean, those guys. I see Tiger up there. Lighten up, Francis. <laughs> Tiger was up there. Uh, I mean, he worked harder than the band, dude. <laughs> so he got the shit beat out of him. And what I had to tell him. Times? And I had to tell him, you know, you guys are up this upstage. You can't be standing up. You got to, you know, you have to kneel. Yeah. And then he was like tackling people. Yeah. And he was getting pissed. Well, he pulled my hair. It's like just push him back, man. Oh yeah. I saw one guy get pulled off the stage. <laughs> I was like, oh, he's not going to have a good night now, is he? And I saw some guy hit the monitor. Did you see that guy? This was on Saturday night. And he went. Somebody get knocked out. Oh yeah, he, he yeah, hit the monitor. His head hit the monitor, out. and it went. Boop. Yeah. He went. But hey, you know what's great is the crowd, and everybody knew how to act, and they knew what to print. They took him off the side. I, I, the ferocity, the reaction that everybody had. I mean, how'd that make you feel? It was insane. What was it like? I mean, to go out there to watch you have so much fun, and I'm not <laughs> saying you didn't have fun in the last 16 years. I know it's fun, you know, but but. This was to your songs, man. This is your lyrics. These are your, this was your band to see you command that. And everybody told me, oh my God, Phil's playing. He was just, a, you know, a witch last night. Just a witch. This is the best and violent so, show I ever played. You th- I think it was one of the ones, best ones I'd ever seen. And it, I don't know if it was because the animosity or the, it was in the air. I just feel that it was, you guys were tight Everybody was into it. The backups were right there. Everybody goes, because I got to stand behind Barry. Yeah. So everybody's back there yelling at him. And, but the teasing, everybody's having a fun, great time. There's 400 people on stage. I mean, the old way it should, the old school. There's no security telling you you can't be here. Well, that's what the, I wanted. You know, everybody was, it was a, whoa, let me get a lemonade. Let me get a blah, blah, blah. It's like, you vibe. know what? You don't need anything. You know, here's your wristband. You can go wherever you want. The dressing room was open. Nobody was checking yeah. shit. You know, people were just walking on stage and, yeah. and hanging out there. And that's what I kind of want to recreate it with the show. It's just Ruthie's 1986 was going through it, my head the whole time. I swear to God, you you captured that. Did you film it? Did you, uh, guys? No, didn't want didn't, that. Yeah. I didn't to, want that. There wanted some people, that... people, people wanted to, like, stream it. And you should do this. It's just like, no, you got to be there. You have to be there. Oh, oh I want to reserve shirt. No, you have to be there to buy the buy shirt. shirt. Yeah, you right. can't pose. Yeah, and, right. Oh, look out. You know, no, you weren't. You yeah. were there if you got a shirt. So, yeah. yeah and they were marked Sunday and Saturday on yeah, them, too. There's two different so, yeah, things of artwork. I, I love that. I thought that that was great. And I, then, and, uh, Again, uh, the sold out, sold, sold out. The fuck out of everybody. I mean, God, I, I would say, I would have to say, uh, I would have to say, there was a lot more people in that venue that probably should have been in that venue. Capacity 1,000. I mean, yeah. Actual, you know, <laughs> attendance, attendance, probably 1,250. 15. <laughs> at one, the, I said, like I said, 
There was the stage went out and the bars behind. If you don't, you never, if you don't live in Oakland, you can't see this club and the bars. And so when they went on, what there the was fuck's the that side, spider doing, man. I can. He's all right. He'll stay. Yeah, hey. He'll stand. Yeah, he stays in the corner. He comes and walks out from time to time because he checks in. You know what it is? It's like, you know what I don't have anymore? I don't have rats down I don't here dig anymore. On, I don't dig on yeah, spiders, yeah, man. No, he'll be all right. Well, like I said, me and him have already had this thing. I won't fuck with you. You don't fuck with me. So, all right. I don't know. He's he's all right. Is there a proximity with that? Like, he ain't going to fuck with me, too? Yeah, if you're in the vault as a guest, it's okay. So, But, I mean... You just this is the thing. Don't look at him, but don't look away either. You know what I mean? It's kind of like that. So right. it's kind of like when you walk by, it's kind of, ah, I'm cool. You're All right, cool. Man. I'm going to jump. You ain't going to jump. What do you mean you haven't ordered your Zetro's Toxic Vault t-shirt yet? Get it. Grayhavenmedia.net. Get it now. There was people there from uh, from Amsterdam, from from Belgium. I'm all, dude, we're playing Belgium. He's like, oh, you guys booked a show right after I bought tickets to come oh my, wow. yeah. I've been waiting 20 years to see violence and I finally come out to see you and you're playing in my hometown, you know. And, uh, from the UK, from, you know, lots lots from over there. It was it was awesome. We Which, did so we do the so we did like as we're we're going, it's like, well fuck, let's do like a meet and greet, like a sound check meet, meet and greet and stuff and give people that didn't have a chance to see the show at least come in and see a couple songs and, you know, get some pictures and stuff like that. But the th- but the thing is with that is that's where the industry's turned now and, and, and to where it's like, you know, when you and I grew up, you couldn't get close to your, I mean, if Jimmy Page wanted to send me a video and cameo, I would have died. You know what I mean? But that's not possible. Oh, but now so it is. You happy know what birthday, I mean? mate. Happy birthday, mate. Like, say, have a happy birthday. Something like, I would like shit my pants. I would never. But that's part of it now. And we I think that the fan... Um, a musician experiences a lot so why not do it and they love it and if they're gonna go for it why not and I and, and well dude they they came in and there was we limited it to 30 and that's they, what they all pile do. in and there's this group of LA uh, LA just kids but they were decked out and you know with the high tops and the peg pants and all the patches and the shirts and like little Mexican girls wearing exciter you know heavy metal maniac shirts and I went holy shit you know and they're they're they come in, we ring out Eternal Nightmare, and it goes apeshit. Yeah. It goes apeshit from the sound check. You had a pit for, it was pit for the meet and, and greet. stage diving. A pit for and the meet and greet. I got goosebumps <laughs> talking about it right now. That's and people amazing. are going fucking nuts, and they're singing the words, and it's like, holy shit, dude. What is going to happen tonight? Well, that's what I said, because I, I actually did get an opportunity. I, I sang with my boys band in Hatred, so when I went out there, I was like, I'm looking at it like, and this is just this. I wonder, can't wait till that. And then when you guys, (laughs) that room, it was like, the whole room just moved. And the four guys that were on stage trying to throw, trying, (laughs) trying to throw people back. It was fucking. They got handled. They got handled. I mean. They, they did you pay those guys something because they those a little did, bit. I, because they <laughs> earned their money that night. That's the only just, thing we paid for. Okay. Really, little well, bit, they earned it. Bit. They earned it. So, um, it was the it was the production cost for for good, this show good. was probably on hundred under hundred bucks. I love that. <laughs> wow, you have to you have to so, come on the vault hey, later and guys, show us how to do that. You guys want to get a backdrop or something? Why would we have a backdrop at Ruthie's? You want to get some scrams? Fuck no, no way. I want to go half stacks if anything. I you hear know, you. Yeah. Just, Easy to get. Do you do do you want to carry it? In, you right? know, three bar cans, fucking killer. There was one flickering <laughs> in the back. I just noticed one that went on and got like that. I was like, this is awesome. Rod, did this, I know you're doing some stuff, I know you guys are doing some shows, did this inspire you guys to go, hmm, maybe we should take another look at this and maybe get together, I know you got tons of material and you're going to stay very active musically, you mean, yeah. you know, you're doing Metal Allegiance, you do, um, you know, all, all, the, all the things that you do musically with all the other people, you know, your endorsements, uh, mm-hmm. you know, you do the Randy Rhodes thing every year. Yeah, you know, I've got. I, so I'm doing done, jammy things. I got. I right. just got offered to do to like do the soundtrack to score a soundtrack for this oh. documentary on Netflix, and I'm gonna do some video game music. Yeah, and stuff so like that. yeah, why not? So anytime you need other music for your trip, man, I got the studio. Oh, I the didn't house. know you were going on that. We can go with that. <laughs> got to get that we superior drum, that Easy Drummer Three, man. I we love can, we that. Can that. Whatever you need. Hey, I'm not opposed. We're just in the beginning stages of this as well. So, right well, you know, I mean, we kinda... we finished last night. I got home. I watched Game of Thrones. I wake up at six, so I got another five hours of sleep, 
And so this is, I, I still know. have Sunday's show well, on my Sunday head right show, now because yeah. I unloaded the gear, yeah, cool. unloaded the violence gear, loaded up the Metal Allegiance show stuff that I'm leaving for tomorrow. Right, right. And, uh, Which I will be, you're going on Metal Allegiance this week. Yeah, uh, yep, yep. And then the four shows. I will be joining you Saturday. Saturday, kick At ass. the Fillmore with the... All the rest of the Exodus guys. So um, awesome. talk about the the stuff that you're going to do with violence coming up and uh, yep. tell everybody where you're going to where you guys are going to be. And um, uh, do you think you may? I mean, are we going to see a new record or at least we're going to see try to do a, at least play more places? Because now because what's going to happen is people are going to see that you've played. People are going to go on YouTube and see, you know, all the stuff, you know, that 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 people because the cameras were flying like it should. So they're going to see and go, hey, wait. When is violence coming to my town? You know what I mean? So what do you think? I've always thought, you know, that nobody outside of the Bay Area really gave a shit. So that's why when, and you've approached me a couple of times about doing some things and just like, it's like, man, I don't think anybody fucking cares, you know? And, and this has, I've got, I'm kind of managing the band right now and, um, cause the dudes have jobs, right? You know? Right. The dudes of have jobs, they, they have kids and, you know, Dean's got this this job that it's hard for him to get away so we're we're just kind of massaging what we can do so we, we've right. got it down to where we can do some weekend stuff and we're that's going good. to and that's, uh, that's the way it is though i mean people don't understand that you know what we did as kids back in the day and those of us who didn't carry on doing this and a lot of people know that i wasn't there for like 10 years and what nine years before that when i did it so uh, you know we had to work we had to hold jobs and 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 they just didn't let you go they don't let you go okay well this guy's a rock star so hey man just call us when you're coming back these guys are running businesses they can't let you go yeah. every time that they want to go you want to leave so you have to weigh the balance as well it's great and it'll be fun but i need a job to come back to so i completely understand yeah. that i went through that myself so right, right. so um yeah we worked together for a minute oh for and, well know, lots of minutes over there <laughs> lots of minutes uh, over there i don't yeah the my tools are around the vault somewhere <laughs> thanks for everybody to subscribing and coming into zetro's toxic vault i'm having so much fun with all of you but you know what i need you to do right now go over to exodus and subscribe to their youtube channel then you will have everything exodus my eye shot yeah and we were like laughing you know, and doing like it amazing it was great just like i said dean's brother i hadn't seen dave in up years front ago. Everybody, everybody. Mark, Mark did a stage dive. My wife did a stage dive. Joey yeah. Houston and his wife did a stage dive. I'm, Jared from Machine Head did a stage, stage dive. dive. I saw that one. <laughs> yeah, everybody. I mean, well, I think there was that one guy who did about 400 stage dives, like the heavy guy with the with the battle jacket. Oh, man, there's a, man. There, it was a flip. You just described half the audience. There was, there check it out. There wasn't. I would say a millisecond where somebody was not coming up and going out. Yeah. It was continuous. The over under I mean, on the mics getting knocked over was at about 120. Well, or so. at one point, <laughs> Dean had taken the mic and put it back by the the drum stand. No, he has two. Oh, okay. He has one okay, up front, well, one I said, in the back. Well, I because I said, well, because you don't want to get hit in the yes. face with that right, thing. Right, 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 right. That makes all the sense. Yep. I remember back in the day. Tom Morea, I mean, God, he used to take mics off the face before yeah. there was ever a, a pit. Tom used to say, I remember him saying, oh, man, I took it off. Every night I'm getting it popped up because yeah, they don't man. know. Yeah, they for just, sure. They just want to flip. Yeah. Yeah, it was cool, man. Right on. Well, hey, man, yeah. thanks for coming in. Absolutely. I know you're really, thanks really for busy. Me. Thanks for coming into the vault. Got to pack the for the other gig. Got to pack for the other gig. If you guys, believe me, if you can get a chance to go see violence on this, on the dates he said they're playing, get a chance to go see it. L.A., if you got a scalp a ticket, go do this. Hey, Alcatraz Fest, you guys are into it. So. Two more shows. We just booked in uh, Brooklyn. Fucking Brooklyn. Fucking Brooklyn. Uh, November OVE. 8th and 9th at the Brooklyn Bazaar. I think that's it. I'm sucking at this. That's Wait. all right. If we know you're in Brooklyn, Spiders blah, 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 me blah, shit, Brooklyn. Man. you get my shit guys. You New York guys, you know everybody from Jersey. I'm not from New York, I'm from Jersey. Get your ass over to me. Over here. Hey, Joe. Violence is only. I think he's turning into a fucking This is a special thing. Dog. You're hearing him say it right there. You know, it may not be something where they can go out and just take care of this. So the few dates that they're going to be able to do are going to be like, you know, those are gold. Those are dust, man. Right on. You, you going to walk me out of here, man? No. I have a talk with the spider. <laughs> anyway, you guys. Uh, so give me some uh, comments. I want to know what you guys think about this. And remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'll be seeing you soon. Mm -hmm.